Tiny Acorn. Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, welcome. On this channel, I like to mix vintage and modern clothing and go thrifting and just have fun with style and throw in a little bit of heart as well. If that sounds good to you, hit that subscribe button. So I have been filming my outfit of the days um, over the course of the last two months and I've just kind of collected a bunch of them and gonna mishmash them into this video today. Some of them are from when I took a trip down to LA to film with Beth from B. Jones Style and we did our come up thrift of this video. And um, I was also down there filming with my friend Arissa from Valley of the Dawn Jewelry. And then the other outfits are from when I was in New Orleans last and I met up with Katie from Fun Styled. I'm excited to share these outfits with you. Just so you know, Every single video, I put everything I can think of in the description box for you guys. Um, I will list out what I'm wearing for each video with links so that you guys can find the pieces yourself if they're still available in stores. If I'm wearing a vintage piece or something that um, isn't available in stores right now, I do try to link similar items in case you're trying to pick up a similar piece for yourself. So that's all going to be in my description box today for every single outfit that I'm wearing. So hopefully that is helpful for you guys. Okay, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. Hey guys, I'm in LA and I'm here filming a couple videos and I wanted to show you my outfit of the day today. So I am wearing my kick crop jeans from Everlane. These bad boys are just some of my favorite pants ever. They're so comfortable. I have them in two different colors. I also got these amazing red day heels that I am in love with. Like, it's almost like a neon red color. I just love it so much. They're also from Everlane. And then for the top, I'm actually wearing this um, vintage blouse that I picked up from the Craigslist ad. Um, and if you haven't seen my vintage haul video, I kind of tell the story of where I got this shirt and like all of these other vintage clothes for free. I decided to pair the whole look with a red lip. This one is a Revlon color that I really like. It is called Love That Red. And then I paired it with these earrings that I got from La Supermarquette when I was in Paris. And then um, I decided to take this coat that I got. Um, it says for people who like touching things. I went to the Restore launch party in San Francisco and um, this is the bag that I got there when I bought some stuff. So yeah, so this is my look for the night. I'm going to go out with my friend Arissa from Valley of the Dawn Jewelry. All right, I'll see you guys later. So I wanted to film my oud. Um, I got this jumpsuit. This is the Japanese Go Weave jumpsuit from Everlane. It's amazing. So incredibly comfortable. I love the fact that it has these amazing pockets. And it comes with a tie at the waist so you can wear it belted or unbelted. Um, and then I'm wearing my day gloves from Everlane as well. I'm going to be walking around a lot today, so I think they're going to be perfect. I paired it with these earrings that I got from Casa Clara. They celebrate female artists, so I'll link them below. And I'm pairing it with this little bag that I got from Crossroads, the backpack. Kind of looks like a pillow, <laughs> but I like that. Hey guys, I am in Fresno at my childhood home. Actually, I am staying in my sister's old bedroom right now. Um, we were traveling back from LA and I just wanted to do a little outfit of the day. I am wearing this new shirt that I thrifted with Beth from Be Jones Style. And then I am wearing these old jeans from ASOS that I got, I think, three years ago. And then I'm wearing the day heel. Yeah, so I just like how kind of like simple this outfit is, but uh, the pop of red with the shoe kind of makes it a little bit more exciting, a little bit more fashion. And then I am wearing a Glossier zip. It's more like a, like a chapstick than a lipstick, I think, and I really like that. And then my rings from Valley of the Dawn jewelry. If you haven't watched my uh, video with Arissa from Valley of the Dawn, please go watch it. She's so cute. And then I'm wearing this, this vintage ring. 
yeah, that's my outfit of the day. All right, so it's my first day in New Orleans and I am going to go thrifting with Katie, AKA Fun Styled on Instagram. She's been sweet enough to take me. So I wanted to show you guys what I decided to wear today. This little uh, set is from my In Her Closet video when Amanda and I went thrifting. Go watch it. She has an amazing wardrobe. But yeah, I found this little outfit when we were there at the Goodwill in Folsom. And it was actually much too big for me and I took it in on the side and down, I took probably about four inches off the waistline and made it fit. And now I'm like super in love with it and it's just awesome. Yeah, and I paired it with these little earrings that I got at this store called Pigment in San Diego. But yeah, I can't decide what shoes to wear. <laughs> I am choosing between these Dolce Vita sandals that I got from ThreadUp and then my Nisolo shoes with the my insoles in them. Um, but yeah, I think I'm kind of going, leaning towards maybe the Nisolos with the insoles because they're going to be much more comfortable for walking around today um, than just the completely flat um, sandal. I went ahead and paired it with my tote that I always wear. So yeah, this is my outfit for today. Hi guys, so I wanted to film my outfit of the evening. I am going to a wedding in New Orleans and it's at a nice church. And so I actually am wearing this little black Zara dress that I thrifted yesterday when I went thrifting with Katie. So this dress is just so fun and it's like elegant and I like how it has an open back and the fabric is just my favorite. And so I got it for like 12 bucks and I paired it with these shoes that I got when I was in Spain. I talked about these in my Europe haul and, um, and then I paired it with this little vintage clutch that I've had for a while. It's kind of elegant. And then these earrings that I got from La Supermarket. Yeah, so that's my completed look. And what are you wearing today? I'm wearing a three-piece suit from a friend of mine's suit shop in San Francisco called mm -hmm. Taylor's Keep. Taylor's Keep in mm -hmm. San Francisco. Yeah, very, very nice. Very nice. Wow, looking good. Good. Handsome, babe. Arr. <laughs> Arr. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go to the wedding, and we'll see you there. That's our look for today. <laughs> So today we're going to be going over to the warehouse district here in New Orleans and it's been pretty hot out so I wanted to wear something cool and breezy and so this dress I thought was perfect. Um, I actually thrifted this when we were in Europe. If you're interested in watching that video, I'll make sure to link it. Yeah, I like how it has like a little pocket here and it buttons all the way down and just really thin so that's nice because it's hot here um, and then I paired it with my Nisolo Harachis and the cool thing is um, I actually bought these on a payment plan with Afterpay so I didn't have to pay the full price up front I just paid it off over a couple of months which is a nice option if you don't have money to invest in the shoes all at once um, and then of course I paired it with my La Bouvette tote that I wear all the time that means leave me alone. So I thought that was pretty funny. <laughs> and then yeah, I just am keeping it simple. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow, bye. So I am getting ready to go out to dinner with my husband and we're gonna go try this new place called, what is it called? Baca. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna go to this restaurant. <laughs> I'm wearing this gorgeous vintage kimono. I stumbled upon this little store on Magazine Street here in New Orleans and it was called White Roach Records. And within the store they have vintage sellers and one of the vintage sellers, Jade, she was there and she was um, restocking her rack. Her store can be found online on Etsy and it's called Ten of Cups Vintage. She specializes in size inclusive vintage clothing that she sources from all over the South, especially at estate sales, 
which if you guys are thrifters and vintage lovers, then you know that estate sales are where all of the treasures are and that's where you want to get your stuff. So check her out. I'm going to link her in the description box down below. She was so sweet enough to give me this gorgeous kimono and it even came with a little belt which is so rare to find with these kimonos so i'm so excited about it because i can wear it as a dress yeah i absolutely love it i love the color i mean this fabric is just so gorgeous and then and i know we're going to be doing a lot of walking so i decided to wear my harachis again I'm wearing my little vintage clutch again and a clip in my hair and then i'm wearing this lipstick by happiness this is the color coral okay so that's my look for tonight see you guys later okay so we're at bacchanal and basically you pick out your cheeses you pick out your wine and then they create a cheese plate for you with like olives and bread and everything and then come and sit on the patio in the back and listen to live music. So yeah, it's really lovely out here. Cheers. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you got some inspiration from this video. When it comes to getting dressed every day, something that can be really helpful is start taking a photo of every outfit that you wear each day and just keep like a photo diary for yourself. If you're having a day where you're feeling stuck you can just go back to your photo diary and find an outfit that you felt good in when you wore it and just put the same thing on. That can be really helpful if you're feeling stuck and you don't know what to wear. So by taking a photo diary, you can see either the pieces that weren't working so well and that you didn't feel so great in and that you probably need to get rid of at this point and let them move on. Or you can see the pieces that were working really well, pieces that you were reaching for a lot. And then you can kind of move your wardrobe towards, okay, these are the, the pieces that work for me. They work for my lifestyle. They work for my body type. I'm pulling them and I'm wearing them a lot. Maybe it's time to invest in versions of those pieces that are maybe a little bit nicer or you don't need to purchase any more of those pieces and you can focus on purchasing the pieces that maybe you were struggling with in your wardrobe. I hope that you know that can help you guys out with giving you some ideas if you're feeling stuck with your wardrobe and where it's at. I want you guys to head on over to my Instagram, Tiny Acorn, because on Tuesday, I am going to be posting a new IGTV video all about my top five wardrobe basics. These are my personal top five. I believe that everyone can have different top five wardrobe basics, um, but I'm going to share with you the top five things that I keep in my wardrobe that I build my outfits around. So if you haven't joined me on Instagram yet, I'd love to see you over there. Don't miss it. It's coming out on Tuesday. Okay. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that video and um, if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you want to subscribe, that'd be cool too. Ring that bell down below. Don't forget that no matter what happens in life, no matter how you feel, that you are beautiful just the way you are. Bye!